This is version 1.2 of Mega Man in the Limelight 2. I don't change his stuff. Hi. Hey there, everyone. This is Rekka playing video game as video game. And join me next time where we're right now. Needle Man, I am lost. I always thought that Needle Man looked pretty cool because he had like a crown. He was the king of the robots. Even though he has... Playing as Metal Man? Really? Oh my god, his saws is cling the stuff. Well, they don't go through... Oh my god, they do go through the... <laughs> Oh man, and he also he jumps weird because he puts his, like, the sole of his feet together. I like taking the time to look at the animation of these Mega Man robots because you can tell they were never really meant to be looked at for any significant amount of time. Anyway, Metal Blade, world famous perhaps a bit of an exaggeration for being hilariously broken in Mega Man 2. Although they don't seem to be as broken in this game. Um, can't have quite as many on screen. They're a bit more awkward to aim. I don't know if this is the fault of... What's that? Shield. Oof. What's that? Hey, it's a squiggly thing! So... I'll be able to get it when I get through shields, I guess. Is that any of my current weapons? This is just like for the sake of bubble 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 bubble. Okay, so I guess not. Wow, Airman, you jump like a crazy person. So, uh, well, that was a bust, and Mega Man looks kind of funky when he is cosplaying as Metal Man and going up a ladder. Whoa, that's crazy behavior. Okay, so that was enough not accomplishing anything ever in the world of ever. And, you know, Metal Man being not able to kill a porcupine. <laughs> or at least having a lot more trouble than Mega Man ever had killing a porcupine. Mega Man 3 is a lot unlike Mega Man 2 in that there's a lot more, like... Enemies that are not unique to specific levels, such as the dragonfly we've already seen, you know, like in Gemini's man's levels. It's uh, something I just realized somehow. The bubblegum machine! Those are fun, because if you press up and start with com uh, controller 2 and they fart, they just throw this super huge stream of, uh, of projectiles. And it made the game lag horribly, and I thought it was the greatest thing ever. Right, me tool? You're a lot less harder to deal with than with Guts Man. Just putting that out there. Like on a boat or something? I never really understood the, the maces going on. Me tool. Actually, it'd be simpler if I, like, trapped you like this and then ran away and then looked at that thing. What's that? What the... What? That's weird. Has like nothing to do with Needle Man, as far as I know. What? What is going on? This? Is, what? Why is this here? I don't like this. Oh jeez, I'm dead. Hi there, ready? How's it going? Okay, when am I gonna figure out the best way to deal with you, me tools? Stupid darn gosh, invincible guys. Uh, see, that's how you deal with them. So yeah, what up with these? That's just weird and came out of nowhere. <laughs> okay! Well, you see, because needles are the foundation for all of construction! That's, that's far-fetched a little bit. It is a duck bringing its own leak for dinner. Right? Is that what it is? Ouch. So, how would you get that? I don't have anyone that can jump there. Maybe Meadowland? Maybe not! Health, that is gratuitous. What's that? Oh, see, so so those panel things are the things for the shields. Got it. So I have that right. I need someone that's maybe like Quick Man, actually. You can't slide, huh? No, you can't. So this, when I think of Needle Man, I think of these little Puncturton things where you need to sli slide. Because Mega Man 3 is the first game where Mega Man could slide. Mecha Plunger Man, you're a crazy guy. By which I mean you are very heavy. And apparently I can, you know, ascertain your... Psychological evaluation through your girth. This is fair treatment of individuals. I'm pretty good at video games, by the way, in case you never notice. I'm, I'm like a master. Video game master -o. So, like, if I shoot the things, they, like, stay? Oh, but why did the thing there did not disappear? Maybe, maybe I need to destroy all of the switches. Got it! I understand now, there's multiple switches in the neighborhood, and they're all up to no good. It's 
pretty, pretty fancy. So, logic dictates that I want to go in this direction, because it's technically a little harder, because you gotta deal with this. Yeah, I think that if you shoot them, they actually do a thing. I just need to be actually able to aim the worth Kipatui's. Oh, I'm not gonna do this jump, except I just did. <laughs> you didn't see that one coming. Hey there, shooter thing. You're shooting exactly where I want to come out. You're... Oh my god, the delay between firing sometimes is incredible. Give me health! <laughs> Survive! Oh -ho! I got my first thing! I got my first thing! I don't know what it does, but I got my first thing! It's not anywhere. But I got my first thing. Maybe it's on the next? Where did you get next? Nope. Well, 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 I got the first thing. I bet you're jealous, Cannon Thing! I got my first thing! It was a lot easier to get than I thought it'd be. I gotta lie. I was expecting this huge snow puzzle... Puzzle Man based weaponry, but no. Let's hope that it sticks around, like, even if I die. Well, I think E-Tanks do that, so... I should be okay. However, you know, as soon as I touch anything, I'm pretty much dead. It's pretty great. Yeah, the Metal Blades are a lot less spammy than they, than they are in the Mega Man 2. So, uh, that's... Also, I got killed. Oh, but I start here. Well, actually, you know what? Let's see if I still got the thing. Oh, yeah, it doesn't say. Darn. Um, well, 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 well then. If you want to be that way, so be it. I am now full. Assad just flew off into the catastrophe. Catastrophe. I'm just gonna destroy the world and all of its worthwhile occupation of Sydney. Because that's a city you want to occupy for some reason, apparently. Alright, there we go. Now I can go into the world of over there, here. Right, Porcupine. Ah, stupid blaze. I'll go through the walls, which is like one of their more of most important... Middle Man! That's, that's her name. I, I felt like I needed to remind you, because I know you are prone to fits of forgetfulness. Wow, I am not playing very good in the slightest. It's pretty incredible. I'm just disbelieving myself. Just destroy the world here. I feel like I'm like in a target gallery here, just being all targeted. Oh, that's right, you can't shoot the walls. Why do I keep resisting that knowledge? Gigaton, why do I keep resisting that knowledge? Why are you so heavy? I'm starting back here. Impossible. So basically, don't get killed at the OK Parade. And so I can have enough health to do a Gigaton at a clock properly. Sounds like a plan. Darn it. Sounds like a secondary plan. Sounds like a target for some reason. Yeah, if I gave... You know, if I anthropomorphized my stores... I think that's how it would sound. Considering the rampant consumerism in both Japan and the United States, kind of surprised corporate stores tans aren't a thing. Although, having said that, and the internet being the internet, I bet it actually does exist, and I'm just blissfully unaware of it. That's kind of sad. <laughs> <laughs> Which part of it is sad, the part that, that it exists or that I'm not aware of it? Probably both. Hi. Oh, I see, you're like the easiest guy to dodge, too. Needle Man's main weapon is doing super huge amount of damage with his body in the original game. I don't know if it's the case in this game, however. He throws around some tiny spikes, but just because there are spikes doesn't mean they're like instant death or anything. Oh my god, he even does like tiny deaths, but he has his, you know, magical crown. And that's basically Needleman in a walnut. Uh, the fight is significantly more like the original game than the other two bosses we've all already fought. So I do like zero amounts of damage to this guy. Well, I do more, but if I'd actually hit him, maybe. As a kid, I always essentially accepted that Needleman is literally impossible, and so all you do is you use the Gemini laser on him forever, and you'd be fine. But, um, realize this is probably never was meant to be the case. 
<laughs> I'm pretty sure if I played Mega Man 3 now, I could weasel a way out and fight him goodly. Until then, um, enjoy the two giant girders in this room. I need to... My problem is that I keep wanting to spam, and that's just destroying my face. Because I cannot. Like, I, I can't, I can't... And I keep missing him. <laughs> that's, that's, a, that's a problem. <laughs> I need to stop missing you. Be against the wall like that, yeah, so that, you know, you can land on... Jeez. Oh, so again, ironically enough... Ah! Stupid saws. Ugh. Ugh. He's not inspired, but... In well, I, like, I'm sure they have the, the equivalent, but it won't use the same imagery. Because they're always stuck. I wouldn't have that much. I'm playing badly again. bias, but... <laughs> Gee, yeah! Oh, what? Oh, come on! Ah, uh, I'm cornered. Just kill me. I get hit by the knees, dumb. How? That took roughly about 40 minutes, more or less, if you're rounding, um, That doesn't matter to me that the boss takes so long, because the first game, you know, definitely got me used to that. I'm just a little puzzled, because Snake Man and Gemini Man were so unashamingly easy compared to this guy, and I'm just kind of slightly confused by that. Yeah, it did save my squiggly thing, whatever it does. I'm just kind of confused. It's saved here, too, for the fun of it. But it's just the thing, yeah, I'm, I'm kind of confused as to why... Oh, well, maybe... It's kind of funny, though, because it's like, it's the one that's closest to the actual real fight without any added gimmick. I can accept that Gemini man, maybe I just accidentally found a way to completely break it, although I kinda didn't really try to break it, but Snake Man was hilariously easy. Anyways, Needle Man! Infamous for giving the first Mega Man weapon that's basically Mega Man's gun, but with different graphics. That's a trend that I could have done without.